I am Melissa Chavez here at Open Source Bridge 2011, and today I am speaking with. I'm Noreen Plunkett. And uh, you are with. Um, I'm with the Apache Software Foundation. I'm the executive vice president there. And I wanted to start off with um, how did you get involved in the open source community? I got involved in open source um, initially, very a very a very brief stint. Uh, trying to be a user, which involved almost throwing a computer out of the bedroom window, trying to install an old version of Linux on an even older machine. Um, and after that sort of fairly failed try, I, I put it on the shelf for a few years. Eventually I came along and started contributing translations, translations particularly into Irish, and from there further contributing documentation to the Apache web server. Um, and about six to eight months after I started uh, working on the Apache web server, I was invited to the Apache conference, which was being held in Dublin that year. And that was when I really, truly started to get involved. I wanted to ask you a bit, because you're with Apache, uh, what are you speaking about at the conference? I'm actually, the, the things I'm talking about here today or this week are not particularly related to my work at Apache. Um, but they are more about how open source is saving the world. It's the stuff I'm really passionate about is making a difference, changing lives, whether it's in disasters and crisis management or literacy bridge, make a talking book, which I just think is the most fabulous piece of both open hardware and open source software that's going at the moment. And uh, what's one of the ways that you're trying to get people to be more involved? I think enthusiasm is catching. I think going out there and talking to people and telling them what's going on, there's a, there's a lot of amazing stuff happening in the open source world that people perhaps don't even know about. And I think sort of spreading the word, sharing what's going on, sharing what I care about is one way of getting, getting other people interested and excited. I think also going to events, having events, showing up at events, Letting people realize that there is this community, there is this vast group of people, we're all connected. I've come here from Switzerland, you know, the, the, the world is smaller than we can imagine. Um, and to realize that there are people all around the world working on the same things that we're working on, who care about the same things we care about, it's just, it's so heartening, it's so encouraging, and I think it's a really good way of getting people excited and, and thereby involved. Okay. Um, can you mention anything else you're passionate about? Um, I love I love getting people started. Getting getting that first first email to a mailing list is a big and scary one. Um, first patch, first patch committed. Getting over those little first hurdles, um, I think, is really exciting and really fun. And so it's it's great to see not only to see people doing that. I've talked to a few people here this week who are very new to open source, even quite new to technology. Um, and so it's been great to, to talk to people who are at that stage now and to be able to encourage them and help them along, but also to see projects like Open Hatch that are doing, doing their bit to make this scalable and to make it easier for more people to get past those first steps. Okay, and um, is there anything else you'd like to add today? I don't think there's anything else to talk about right now. All right, thank you so much for your time. Thank you.